Hey cute people, yes, it's me again with another Dollar Tree haul. This is really a collective haul, but the last time I went was just a couple of days ago. When that lady told me how much money I spent, I almost had a fit. I don't think I've ever spent that much money um, in Dollar Tree at one time. Maybe several times in a week combined, but not one time. I think it was like $46. I almost had a fit. So I'm going to get right into what I purchased. I want to show this to you, although it is not in season, but yep, I sure did. I went and got another Christmas tree. Yeah, because I already have one. I didn't put up Christmas tree um, this Christmas past only because, remember, I moved my stuff down here and pretty much took up my whole living room and I hadn't made any space, so I did not put up the little Christmas tree, but I missed it, and I didn't even do any lights, but I'm waiting for next year. I'll be ready, because my apartment, at least you'll be able to walk through it. If I have everything I need at the time, that's a different story. But then I bought this towel. I like to buy the little um, kitchen essentials from Dollar Tree for the occasion, and I bought this mitt. So I'll have all this stuff for next year. And I bought the little... What do you call these pot holders? Yeah, so I got those things on sale. I picked up these slippers here, and I was trying to see if I could find some more, but I didn't see these exact ones. They had some other ones, but um, you got the little rivets on them. Yeah, they had some other ones like you just slip your feet into, like the old back in the day slippers. I'm sure your grandma had some, cause my grandma did. And um, these really are cute. You know, they, they're nice, feel good. The only thing about slippers like this, I, you have to put them on. You just probably slip your foot into them, but they don't have enough support for you to probably slip your whole foot in at one time. But they're cute, a dollar. They had a lot of different designs. I wish I had gotten more, but I got what I saw. And then sticking with kitchen, I did pick this up, which this is um, pretty much in season. <laughs> I think you should say, but I really wanted this. I thought it was really, really cute, and I got it. Our nest is best. Yeah, I think they had the pot holder for this. I didn't see the oven mitt, but this is a little different. It's not the same. It's not the set, but I got our nest is best, and I saw this, which I didn't see the hand towel, but if I go to another Dollar General and I'll see it, because I like it to... Um, well, in the kitchen for the thing to run about the same pretty much so right now i still have the barbecue of a mid pot holder and towel yeah i also bought this because i don't have a drain i usually get these whenever I, whenever i see them i got these these are it's a dish drying mat i got two so that they cover the whole space because these are not really let me see hopefully i can just pull it out because these are not really big and my drain it doesn't cover the whole base of the drain you know on the bottom on the cabinet so you can see it's not really big it's not really big and my drain is much bigger than it so i just doubled up you know side by side and I like these things. Yeah, because like I said, I don't have a drain. These are pretty good. And I think it's a good thing to switch them out kind of often because, you know, the water, mold, and things like that. And you can, you can wash them. Cold water. I also picked up some more candles. Why? I don't know. But I got these um, Coastal Breeze. Mm, they smell good. But I definitely needed these here because I have to get a what do you call that? A hurricane lamp. And when I go to Walmart tomorrow, I have to remind myself to get one. Even though it's not hurricane season. But it's best to be prepared. So this here is a six-piece, five-hour emergency candle. So I got these. As a matter of fact, I'm going to get some more. And again, because I live in an area where hurricanes come through. So I need to be prepared. And I picked up this rug here. I My mother picked up one. I said, oh. I need to get one. It's a ribbed floor mat. Yeah, pretty decent. Yeah, so I figured I'd use this here um, at my back door because every time someone goes, I don't have a mat at the outside or the inside. And, you know, I figured for a dollar on the outside can't be too bad. You light candles, 
always keep these in the house. If you have one that's working, no problem. When you go to Dollar Tree, pick up one or two extra ones because you got to have these. So I picked that up. I had seen someone's video, well, not even just one person, quite a few people talking about this item here and it says that it works. It's a drain router. I had always seen it in Dollar Tree, but I didn't think it would work. And I'm not sure it does, but a lot of people say they um, find that it works. So I got this because I can tell my bathtub's um, a little backed up. So I wanted to get this to see if I can get some of that gook out of it. I brought this here. I used to always use a dish pan um, to wash dishes because I think that it helps preserve water than when you run the water um, to wash dishes. So I got this, but this time I'm going to use it for... Um, if you watched um, some of my other videos, you'll know that I moved my things in from New York, from New York, and um, you know the situation that I had. And as a matter of fact, I'll link that video up above so you can see it. But a lot of things I need to clean with the Clorox mix. And like I said, if you've seen the video, you know why. If you haven't seen the video, check it out. But I'm going to use this for small things to put, you know, like. Clorox and water and soap so that I can clean some things because um, they have to be clean. And you guys may be, well, I'm sure you probably figured out that I like plants because in some other Dollar Tree hauls I did show some um, planters that I bought, the pots and things. So I got this here. This is just a plant label. You have 10. I have to get some more of these. Yeah. And you just write on it what type of um, plant it is. And I do have some herbs. And I usually keep the um, label from the plant, like when you buy it from the store. But I like this. Because I have some that I need to cut and, you know, propagate and give away. Because it looks like I'm going to have a lot of plants. And I like these for starting um, seeds or propagating small plants. So I got these. Um, I think they're really cute. Let me tell you, this here um, is fresh linen. I hauled some other ones that I have. This one, I can't say I smell much, but this one here is fresh linen, and it's um, a fragrance oil. And I can't say that I smell it much, but I have two other ones, and fortunately, I keep them right here in this drawer. It's one of them that I really like. Now, this one here is melon and raspberry. And this one is coconut and citrus. These two. I think it's this one that I really like. Um, melon and raspberry. And I know um, they were running low on these. I guess you just see them pretty much in the summertime. So I can't say you'll see them now. But this I can say, uh, I'll try it. But the, um, I'll say it again, the melon and raspberry is the one I really like. And you really do smell them. Because I have, um, mm, I have like um, several little oil burners. And yeah, you really can smell these things. You'll be surprised. Okay, now, another thing I picked up, I showed you that, I showed you that. I love their home decor, so I picked this up. I think it's really cute and chic, you know, something that you would see maybe in, maybe even CB2, Curtain Barrel, um, Crate and Barrel, Pier 1, Urban Outfitters. It's just really cute, only one color they had. I should get another one and just spray paint the whole thing because the base is black. And it's really cute. I got this. I'm not sure why I got this here. Um, but I'm going to use it for something. You can see it's an apple. It's pearlized. I don't know if you can see that. If I do it up close, can you see? Yeah, there it is. I thought it was so cute. Um, Dollar Tree has some of the cutest home decor. And then another thing I picked up, which I, I need to get to using. And I picked this up here. This is a calendar for 2020 of course and you stick it on the refrigerator because it has the magnet I mean if you can if you have a locker or something you can stick it on there anything like that um, I'm going to put this on my refrigerator it has the calendar and a little notepad that you can use it'd be cute it would have been cute if they had a little place where you can stick the pen because now you got to always look for a pen unless it fits in here but I'm going to 
put this on my rip fridge. And then I bought these two, which I thought was so cute. I wish they were a lot bigger, bigger, but for a dollar, you can't go wrong. And these are the, um, it's the table calendar, the desk calendar, right? So I bought this one for myself. And I have the desk from Ikea. Oh, I don't know what the name of it is. But, of course, this won't fit the whole um, tabletop. But I got this one for my room. The desk in my room. And then I got this one for the desk in my son's room. I thought it was really nice. Even though we are halfway over with the month of January, we'll still be able to use them. And you know something? I had watched someone's video. I don't remember who. And they showed these earrings and i said no way but way i guess you can purchase these for valentine's because it says i love you and love you but i got these earrings here and you know the funny thing about these earrings here they look cute you see they got a little feather a little um love knot they had these in silver also and they had other styles but these are the two i really like especially the love knots i should get a silver pair i mean a dollar you can't beat that I know you've seen these around and I had to have this. Yes, I did, honey. Girl boss. That's me. Girl boss, lady boss, the boss. I am the boss. And it does cost to be the boss. But I got this. I really liked it. I think it's really cute. Especially with that, um, this purple. Let's see if you can really see the purple. It's in it. They had other ones and this is the one I really like. I can't rem remember the other um, sayings that it had on it. You know, girl, guys, I'm going to the Dollar Tree again tomorrow, honey. Yes, I am. Yes, I am. I'm going right to Dollar Tree. And then I got this here. This is a book bin. And I got this. Um, why not? <laughs> um, it's a book bin. You put some books in. They had other colors, but this is the color I got, which is like a beige color so i got that i do buy things for the home um usually i don't show them but i want to show you these because i got um the cascade platinum what do you call these dishwasher don't these things have a name hmm. well here it is and it says that they have the grease fighting power of dawn so they are four fresh scent action packs if you can see that but i got these because i bought the um, brand from walmart but it seems like the dishes were always streaky i don't know if it was the the um dishwasher itself or the soap that i use the detergent we use but i don't use the um washer dishwasher often i find it's easy to just wash the dishes and put them away yeah I got this, which I thought was really surprising. I think this is really a great buy. I need to buy one for my mama, but I got this. This is a car visor tissue kit. It fits any visor, it, visor it says, and it's made out of durable vinyl, and it's refillable. And it's just a where you can put your tissues. You stick it up on the visor. Is it enough for you to see it? Let's see if you can see it this way. Yeah, you put it on the visor and you put some tissues in it. And I think this is really great because you're in your car, you'll be in there for a while, put this in there, and then you have some tissues at your visor. You pull your visor down and you get some tissues. So I got this. I thought this was a great buy. And yeah, did I show you everything? Yes, I did. And guess what? This video won't be more than 15 minutes if I stop talking now, right? But listen, that's my Dollar Tree haul. Again, this haul is just to show you guys some of the things that I picked up. Some things that you may be interested in or some things you realize you just may need. But yeah, that's my haul. I will not be Dollar Tree hauling very much longer because when I go in there, I just see things that I like. Not necessarily that I need. So I have a Dollar Tree closet. Well, on the bottom of the closet is nothing but home decor and a whole bunch of stuff you know but i'm glad i can switch it out but listen i'm going to end this video here because it's sunday afternoon i want to fry some chicken only a couple of pieces of wings that's all i'm going to do nothing elaborate but i got the next two days off y'all so really three days sunday monday and tuesday i'm gonna go shopping tomorrow have some fun and um yeah hopefully i'll talk to you guys in the next couple of days and I want you guys to do nothing but share and spread love. I'll see y'all sometime this week. I don't know what I'm going to talk to y'all about, but I will see you guys.
She ever spread love. 15 minutes and a couple of seconds. Not bad. Bye.